So we're probably going to see some rebels pop up in Northern Africa, and uh, I even increased my autonomy over the break to 100%, so I I thought that that would kind of lower the chance of, of uprising, but it totally didn't. It barely took off any percentages. So uh, yeah, I mean, that's going to be a troubled area. I figured that, but it's all about the, you know, the location. It's all about the geography there, because I can decide if I want to, to continue to expand towards the Islamic nations in Northern Africa. Eh, yeah, so I, I don't know. We'll see. I, I just... I... <laughs> I don't know. It's at it's right now. It's at eighty uh, percent, and the progress. It's going to continue to increase by it's it's twenty point seven is the chance of uprising. Uh, as and I think that's going to continue onward. I mean, I let, I let some a couple months tick by uh, after I increase the autonomy. It's still at twenty point seven chance of increasing. So uh, yeah, it, it's it, this that's going to be an uprising. I've got a few more regiments coming from Sardinia and Corsica, uh, as well as I, I removed the three thousand stack that was kind of stuck in Australia or Austria. Uh, I don't know why I almost dropped Australia there. Yeah, I'm, I'm moving these 3,000 men and we are kind of going to send over a few of the transport ships and begin for a small little uprising there. Shouldn't be no problem. We're also going to go to war here in the northwest, uh, so we'll see what happens. Also, one thing I wanted to make a make a comment on, uh, I, I, I do realize that most of this land is claimed by Great Britain. And, well, to be honest, fuck them. I can't do anything about it. You know, like it's just... Great Britain needs to go screw themselves here because they have claimed just about every single other thing in the world, uh, or I guess in North America. Uh, I mean, they already have British Mexico here, which is huge. The only place I could have gone after was Louisiana. And you know what? No. Well, because well, Norway's already here by now, but uh, I could have gone after Louisiana, but I would have been right next to British Mexico. And honestly, I don't want, I, I know that that would have pulled us into a war with Great Britain, which probably isn't terrible. But if it was a colonial war, then yeah, I'm not going to be able to help out my, you know, uh, Sardinia, Piedmont, Louisiana. They're not going to have any chance against this massive force in in, in modern day Mexico. So uh, at this point, I don't care. Uh, I, I guess I should probably tell myself to expand out towards the west a bit more. It depends on, you know, what Norway does. Uh, maybe we can go after Norway and kick them out of here. But uh, I guess that's what we should do. But at this point, it's like, what else am I going to do right now? I, I, I wanted to go after Florida. Uh, it seemed like the most open area, but I get that. I should watch out for it because it's going to take me longer to colonize. I don't care if Great Britain doesn't like me as much, and I don't care if the Pope doesn't like me as much. Those nations, I don't like it in the first place. Uh, so it, it, that's not the problem here. The problem is, you know, obviously the colonization. And, and does it actually show me a penalty? Um, is there a modifier or an explanation? There it is, Treaty of uh, I'm sorry, I, told, I, was, I almost said Versailles. Yeah, negative 20. Wow. Okay, that's uh, pretty significant. I will say that is pretty damn significant. So I guess we'll just start to expand towards Louisiana territory. I don't know. We'll see. It's just, I'm not worried about it. It's fine. It's fine. So anyways, let's let's go to war. Uh, let, let us go to war right now. Take these guys down. All my Both my allies are willing to join in. Uh, it looks like I think Scandinavia is not going to join in on their side, so that's nice. And uh, we need to be prepared. What do you want? What is this particular province that you want me to take? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. That's not right, is it? Uh, am I? Oh, I'm smoking crack here. I, I did, was not typing that in the right way. Oh, okay, yeah, no, that mission's not going to happen. Never mind, so, okay, that's fine. All right, let's go in after it. So I've got a two-star general there. I've got a two-star general down south. So let's let's move into territory, try to stack, wipe them as fast as possible. They're already located in grasslands. So, I mean, I can't I can't complain. This is great. Uh, I need to watch out for this stack. This stack's very huge with 35,000 men. There's not that many provinces that have that supply limit that can hold a regiment that large. But uh, we'll kind of keep an eye on that. And because this general has a bit of maneuver, to maneuver exactly, uh, I think we should be able to get there in time. Uh, their general also has maneuver, but he's not even moving, so it's fine. Uh, the 35... Wow, did we just stack wipe him? Wow. Okay. Uh, yeah, I I wasn't expecting that, but thank you. Uh, that was cool. Okay, down here, I guess we'll split you guys up. Uh, now, there is a fort in Gascon here. So we'll go after that fort, and we'll put the... Uh, We'll put the general in there. He's got no siege value. That's too bad, but that's okay. Uh, I, like I said, I mean, this is this should be a pretty walk, a nice little walk in the park. Bavaria, Munster, they're not going to do anything to us. Uh, Australia, uh, Aust oh my gosh, I almost called them Australia again. Austria should be able to kind of you know deal with both of those nations. So, um, and Portugal probably doesn't even have to do anything. I mean, if they want to do something, that's fine. You know, you guys go ahead and and do whatever you want if you want to kind of jump in, jump in here. Uh, I'm still kind of creating a few more regiments here and there. Uh, another idea group possibility. How are we doing in, in technology? Seems like we're doing okay. Do I want to pay for this? Yes. Yes, we do. 
Uh, I'm way ahead in administrative power anyways, as it is, and uh, I would love to get another merchant because we're trying to transfer more trade power. I've already controlled the entire Genoa trade node. I've been, I've been making a lot of money because I control just so much of the Mediterranean trade nodes. Uh, let's continue to kind of press that. So gang papal influence, don't really care about that. Uh, let's, let's, what do we, do we get anything from the Pope? The papal state disregards the Pope's uh, decree. I have no idea what that means, um, but why would I want them to hate me even more? I mean, what's the op opinion at now? It feels threatened. I mean, I can gain some papal influence as well as global tariffs till 1790. Whoa, whoa, okay, 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 fine. I don't see why not. I don't see why I wouldn't take that, but I don't really care about the Pope. Anyways, let's before we jump into that war, because that's going to be a landslide, not, not a big deal. Let's double check and see where our merchants are at. I believe both of my merchants are transferring trade power, which is a pretty dang good idea, I would say. Um, now, is there anything else, maybe transferring from Venice, although, you know, you know collecting from Venice might be a good idea, because uh, I'm, I'm, I'm technically, my home trade node is Genoa. I can collect from Venice without getting a huge penalty, I believe. Now, I don't control that much power here in the Venetian trade node. Oh, yes, I do. Whoa, 59, yeah, I do. Okay, so let's, let's collect there. And, again, because, let's see here, which one is not being used... Will arrive here, arrive here. Okay, boom. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to collect here. I think I was collecting from... Oh, no, I wasn't. I don't know. No, no, never mind. I was fine. I was right. I was just transferring trade power. Okay. Uh, yeah, so because I, I believe I believe I have that correct. Because I am not... My home trade node is, you know, whatever Sardinia Piedmont's capital is. Uh, that that would give me a penalty if I collected from, my, from Genoa. From Venice, I think it's fine. But we'll see. We'll see. I could always transfer trade power, but is there a way from transferring from Venice to Genoa? No, there isn't. Oh, wow. I didn't even notice that. Okay, yeah. So collecting would be the best case scenario here. All right, kind of let's keep our eyes on any sort of, uh, I don't know, random regimen that might come after us. There might be a few, possibly. We'll have to go, we'll have to go after Orleans soon. I guess I should give you some backup or we'll, we should just be careful. Let's just be careful. Whoa, wait a second. How did, wait, where did all those sieges go? Hey, 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 where did those sieges go, man? They just all left. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because we didn't get any... Oh, I'm so confused right now. Okay, well, whatever. No big deal. Uh, I guess Portugal decided to help us out a little bit, so hopefully they go and do something. How's the chance of uprising in North Africa? Oh, it's at 90%. Okay, wait a second. Are we even prepared for this? Not really. Okay, so get on board the ships... And get ready. I'm hoping the force that I have kind of built up is going to be enough. I don't think so, to be honest. But uh, we'll see. Send you guys down that way. I believe I have one more regiment coming in each one of those provinces. Okay, there we go. Still no forts, though. I don't think we acquired any. Oh, yeah, we did. We acquired one fort. Let's go ahead and grab... Let's go ahead and grab... Uh, that's no fort there, either. Okay, let's take out the one stack. Move you in. Oh, there, wait, 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 no, go there. There you go. Aha, and Portugal's helping us out a little bit. That's nice. That's nice of them, right? That is pretty nice of them. Okay, stack wiped them. Stack wiped to 1,000 men. Nothing, no, no, no big deal there. And uh, we still need a lot more. And how much manpower? Oh, I'm losing manpower. That's right, because I, there's there's no supply limit in those lands to, to kind of keep up with our massive regiments. Okay, so we only have 6,000 men. That's a little bit scary. And uh, you know what? I think I was wrong. I don't think I have three more guys coming. Let's go ahead and do that. And, and I think a nine stack should be good. Let's hope. Let's hope that a nine stack's good. I, I have no idea. Uh, and we should also maybe give you a general. No, because we, we don't. We can't afford it. Yeah, I already have my king as a general. And we have just a regular general. So, yeah, something to keep in mind. How much attrition am I suffering from? 2%, 2%. That's not bad. Well, I'm just losing manpower like flies right now. It's just crazy. What is going on here? Okay, Portugal, do the job for us, man. I don't want to have to do this. Can we move in there? We can't move in there. Oh, there goes the revolts. Oh, of course. Of course they did. Oh, this ain't good. This is not good. Okay, so what we'll probably do... Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Are you telling me that a no leader here with a third of the army is going to win this? Maybe. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my goodness. No way. We got to get some rolls, though. We're getting some bad rolls last minute. There we go. Come on. Ah, that was it right there. That was the that was the nail in the coffin. Maybe not. Nope. Yeah, it was. Okay, where where do we get? Oh, we got stack wiped. Fantastic. Okay, great. And then you have ten years of nationalism. That's great too. 
Okay, so you're going to go that way. I'm going to send the 24 stack over this way, or the 24 stack of transport ships. That way we can start to retreat some of these guys back home. Or I guess we retreat. Uh, yeah, I guess they're going back home technically, but they're going to be sent to northern Africa uh, to deal with these guys, these rebels, these uprisings, before they just totally mess us all up. Okay, so maybe I should send the 18 stack here. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, no big deal. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. We'll be able to... Completely wipe them out pretty fast here. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. Now, how much is my supply limit? Oh, we've got plenty of supply limit in, uh, in that province. Wow. Okay, let's drop you off this way. I don't think I need to go for any more men. That, that should be enough. Yeah, I mean, I could, I could go after the three stack, but uh, why? You know why? I don't see why. Uh, I don't have any diplomats doing anything. Let's see how my opinion is with Portugal and Austria. Seems to be doing okay. Um, can we increase that opinion at all? Um, yeah, I don't think I've, I don't think I have done anything. I don't think I've decided to suck up to you anytime soon. Let's go ahead and do that. Why not, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Let's improve with Portugal as well. How you feeling, buddy? You liking us, man? You still liking us? Good, 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 good. Okay, so here's the 24 stack. We should be able to walk in here pretty easily. I guess, I guess we'll have the 3 stack do something, because why not? They're just going to sit in Sardinia the, their entire lives, so... I guess, why not? Okay, they're running too. Come on, go after him, go after him, catch him. There's no way we're going to catch him. Oh, we did catch him, wow. Okay, no leader, we're getting a crossing penalty, so this is not the most efficient way to save manpower, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> what else are we going to do? And you guys go over this way. Boom, there you go. And it's all over. Okay, so how's the war going? I, I wasn't even worried about the war. I was more worried about these rebels than anything else. I'm sure we're going to have an uprising soon. Possibly. Uh, may maybe not. Maybe not. It looks like we have a better hold on it than before. All right, we got to finish these up. Let's go ahead and move up to s speed four. We just finished a fort, and uh, you go out this way. I want 100%. I want 100%. Okay, so Bavaria is done. If, if, let's go ahead and recall this, uh, this diplomat here. Bavaria is done. Let's go ahead and make sure that... Wait a second. Does, does Austria have any claims on Bavaria? Because if they do, that's going to be a problem. They don't. Okay, so everything's fine. Okay, let's go up to them and say, hey, buddy, I'll let you off the hook. But first of all, let's see. What are you going to suggest? Can you give me some money for it? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Give me some money. There we go, buddy. I like it. All right. That's nice. That is nice. And is there... Where's the, where's the next fort at? Okay, there's no more forts. We can't get up around this way, so... No problem. A general has died. No, I didn't even see that. I didn't even see... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. That is crazy. That, by far, is the best general I have ever had. By far. That's the best general I have ever had. Is that is that a three-star? You think? Yeah, looks like it. Is that the, the those dashes? I don't know. Five fire, one shock, no siege, but six maneuver as well. That is crazy. Very, very good for our artillery. Um, that's gonna be nice. No, can we uh, can we also peace out with Munster? No, not yet. Austria, what you doing, man? That's your only job is to take out Munster in, in Bavaria. I'll, I'll handle everything else. I mean, I understand you have the harder job there, but I'm just saying, like, <laughs> can you not do that? Okay, so let's go after maybe better relations over time. Yeah, let's go ahead and grab that guy. And 975, not bad. I think I'll keep it like that. Uh, again, the economy's... Oh, the economy's doing a lot better now. 15.54. Whoa. Yeah, we're doing really well. Last time I checked, it was it was at like two ducats. It was some like ridiculous stuff like that. So uh, things are doing a lot better. Diplomatic uh, relationships. We don't need another one. We've already have five. We only you know we already have three slots open. I might as well grab the uh, the diplo points because why not? And uh, let's go after the final two provinces here. You can run back home. Make sure you don't suffer from too much attrition. Hopefully, there we go. Supply limits at fifty eight there. And uh, we might want to think about going to war with Great Britain. They already have a negative 200 opinion of us, so that's that's pretty nice. Uh, you feeling the you feeling the heat yet, Munster? Kind of. Uh, it's very close. We might be able to peace you out soon. I pretty much have a 100% war score. We can probably peace out now. I've only I'm at 2,000 manpower, so let's go ahead and do that. Uh, even though now I'm probably not suffering from any attrition, but still, why not? Let's let's go ahead and see what we can take. I'd like to take a lot. Now, I'm doing good in, administrative, in the Ministry of Technology, and uh, in, terms of, in terms of, like, aggressive expansion, everything's fine as well, too, right? Yeah, I've, left, I've let it all take down. Oh, yeah, so we're going to take a lot here. Ooh, ooh, I feel bad for you, buddy. This is going to be bad. 
How much can I take? Can I take like six provinces? So this would be 81 overextension. That's not terrible. Uh, you're talking about quite a bit of aggressive expansion from uh, quite a bit of aggressive uh, aggressive expansion from the HRE. So I'm I'm a little bit fearful of that. I'd like to gang. I think we've talked about this. I'd like to gang more coastal provinces, especially uh, along the Atlantic Ocean. That would be great. So maybe we remove this. Will you guys go ahead and keep a hold of that? What if we did something like that? That way we could also go to war with Provence. Uh, now we're talking about still quite a bit of aggressive, aggressive expansion. Oh, actually, no. Okay, because we're not moving. Oh, so we, we just take, you know, we just remove some of these northern provinces and we don't have to deal with uh, those guys anymore. What about this? Do we still get the aggressive expansion? Now this is not for sure. Okay, fine, fine. Let's just go with that. Let's go with that. You're talking about quite a bit of aggressive expansion, still a bit, a bit of overextension too. I'll take all your money. And uh, can we have you release a nation? Oh, we can. Oh, well, hot dog. Oh, we can have you release Brittany. Yes. This is only 39 war score here. Oh, you're, you're doing a lot here. We're going to have you release a whole bunch then. So, yeah, release Brittany. Although, is that the best idea? I don't know if that's the best idea. But then again, you know, you know divide and conquer. I think that's the kind of the theory that we should go with. My fear is that maybe we shouldn't have this na nation be released because I'm, I'm afraid that Great Britain is going to go after that. Um, yeah, because it'd be tough to vassal. I don't have a core next to that vassal anyways. Uh, yeah, so that, that would probably be just a bad idea, giving England more power. And no, 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 you guys, you keep those alliances. Again, that's the strategy that we're going with. It worked last time. Keep those alliances because those guys aren't anyone to worry about. Oh, I can't vassalize you. That would be fantastic. Uh, that would be really, really cool. Sardinian vassal. Um, dang. That, that, wait a sec. Wait, 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 wait a second. Wait a second here. You're telling me that if I remove this stuff... Oh, okay. Okay, never mind. Wait a second. Wait a second. I can vassalize... Oh, no, that's 119. What if I go 1, 2, and then vassalize the rest? Where, where, why is the war score so... Okay, okay, so never mind. I'm getting a little bit confused here. I thought I had a chance of, of vassalizing you, but I guess not. Well, I guess we can next time. Now you're at 70%. Enforce fleet basin rights, enforce military access, no, give up claim, no, you can have the claim. War operations, transfer trade power. I'd like the trade power from the... I don't know if you have anything in the English trade node. Can I can't do both here? Uh, I definitely cannot do both. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that that's that's fine. That's, that's all we'll do then. Um... Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Okay, let's go ahead and core this stuff too, because that's going to be quite a bit. Now, do we have we have a little bit of administrative power? Not too much, though. So this is going to be a long, slow... It's going to be a slow process. Okay, move you out that way. And then the 18 stack can move this way. Okay, there we go. And what do we have? National unrest, fort defense, mercantilism. Let's go over that mercantilism. You want to be my ally, Brittany. Okay, wait a second, wait a second. Before I do that, can I vassalize you? Yes, I can. All right, that's exactly what I'm looking for. I will royal marriage you as well, and then boom, you'll be an excellent vassal if I can grab a hold of it. Um, I need to improve relations, though, with as fast as possible. And also, Provence, do you like me? You hate me. Yeah, you, you don't like me. Okay, that's fine. Okay, well, I, just, I just wanted to see. I just wanted to see. You know, it's, it's fine. Okay, September 22nd. And then uh, we'll begin to improve relations, and I think we should be good. It seems like we are going to be the ones to do it. Hey, 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 what are you doing in Portugal? You better get out of here, Portugal. Okay, we have established a colony. Truce has expired with the Ottomans. All right. And uh, which one has been... Okay, this one. Okay, so like I said, let, let, let's go ahead and move out this way, even though it's probably less value uh, moving towards Louisiana. I, yeah, I, I imagine there's probably less base tax involved in this region, but that's fine. Let's go ahead and send them out, and then we'll move like this. And uh, hopefully Italian Florida helps us out. Okay, trade dispute with the Ottomans, that's fine. And uh, we'll try to get out here as fast as possible. The problem is that we need to get several more provinces under our control before we get onto uh, unclaimed lands by Great Britain. Is this one almost done? It is kind of almost done. Done. Uh, and the problem is that how fast is... What is Norway going to do? Well, we'll just go to war with Norway. I'm not worried about it. As long as Norway doesn't establish a colony, we'll go to war with Norway, completely wipe them down, take all their stuff, and uh, everything shouldn't be a problem. But I think we'll do like a new world war soon. But uh, wait, what, what, what is this real quick? National unrest for till for the next five years. Let's go ahead and go that. Yeah, we can fight some rebels off. Uh, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.